Oftentimes when we get those holiday sides of cooking in the oven or the stove top, we kind of get in a rut. We kind of do the same old things, right? This is going to be a very unique potential side dish recipe for you this holiday season or really any season. It is roasted baby carrots, red onion and grapes. Yes, grapes, and we're going to have a lot of different flavors added to that. Super easy, and I think it's super delicious as well. So in this bowl, I have a bag of those little baby carrots that you can buy already bagged in the grocery store. To that, we're going to add about a half of a large red onion, or one medium onion, red onion that you cut into wedges. Put all those dudes in there. I'm not going to put the grapes in, though, just yet. That's going to come later on. So we have those carrots and also the, oh, I took the top off, and also the onion in there. Now we're just going to add some good quality olive oil, a couple tablespoons or more. And then we're going to add our spices, and that's going to include some black pepper. I'll have measurements for you when I have the recipe on the website later today. Some cumin. We're also going to add some salt. It's going to use this Himalayan rock salt again. Love using that. And of course, my favorite thing, which is very, very essential for this particular dish, red pepper flakes. We eat so much pizza here at Kitchen Tune-Up. They have so many of these little packets. Remember, I would always tell you to save those packets if you don't use them. Turns out the amount of red pepper flakes in one of these is usually the amount you want in your recipe. But you know what? I'm going to double it today. I like a lot of heat, and we have a lot of other stuff going on here. So get all those dudes in there. And let's see, what else do we need? I think that's just about it for right at the moment. So take a spoon and stir all these things around. We want to make sure all the vegetables are coated with the olive oil. We also want to distribute the spices. And you know how to roast stuff, right? You just take a roasting pan and lay anything, everything out in one layer. So let's go ahead and get that done. The oven is preheated to 375 degrees. I want on my pan here, I want to line that with foil. That's easy for cleanup. And then dump all the stuff out and spread it in one single layer. Make sure you get all the oil and spices out. It's important that this is all in one layer so everything cooks evenly and actually cooks. So we'll get all that done like that. And this is going to go in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes until the carrots are softened. Then after that, I will pour the grapes, the seedless red grapes on top, mix them in, and then I'm going to roast it for five to ten minutes more. See, a very exciting thing happens when you cook grapes. They will start to crack and burst a little bit, and the flavor is fantastic. Don't shy away from cooking with grapes. It's really an amazing thing to do, and it adds so much depth of flavor and some wonderful flavors to your dish. When the French use grapes in their cooking, it's called Veronique. You can use the white grapes with fish, red grapes with chicken, and we're going to use these red grapes a bit later on with these vegetables right here. I will add those grapes to this mixture probably just after the weather segment. So anyway, this is going to go in the oven. Again, it's very important the oven is preheated. 375 degrees. Don't really need to stir it too much. Just let it cook in there for 10 to 15 minutes. Add the grapes and the dish is done. It is as simple as that. Roasted baby carrots, red onions and grapes with so many wonderful seasonings that will give it a little bit of a kick. Easy recipe and try it for your Christmas side dish or some other side dish this uh, winter season. How about that weather? It's feeling like Christmas. It's cold, but it's going to get warm soon. I'll have the complete forecast coming up in just a couple of minutes.